Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Calvin Allen with One Kicks and today we're going to review another shoe from the closet. Uh, today we're going to talk about the Jordan 5 Midnight Navy. That's what it says on the box. Jordan 5 Midnight Navy. Um, I have worn these before. Uh, they originally dropped, let's see if I can find a date in the shoe. Actually, I don't even see it on here. Okay, well, it dropped some time ago. A few years ago and I picked up this pair I think I gotta end up getting it from Foot Locker online or something like that so let's check it out it's, uh, it's, it's, it's more of a purple but it's calling it midnight navy it's a really that purplish blue color um, and we got the lighter blue up there that matches right there uh, clear and blue bottom I've worn these before I've worn these I think twice I got an interesting story about the fives this shoe I like the five silhouette. Uh, we got the Stitch Jumpman logo on the back. But I never could figure out the lace lock. I don't know why, but whenever I do the lace lock, it'll end up on my shoe like this. I can never figure out. And this is how it came. So I, I can never figure out how to get it tight where it's against my shoe like that. And you can see it because it has that uh, Jumpman logo on the inside there. I don't know if you've just seen it or not. So I never figure out the lace lock, how to really work it correctly. But secondly... This shoe hurts my foot. I don't know what it is about something at the top of the toe box, but it felt like it was digging into my foot. I, I'm sure it's a manufacturer flaw for this shoe. Um, so like I wore it like once, and when that started happening, it's, it's been in the box since then. And you can kind of see a little wear on the on the creasing there. It creased pretty bad. Um, let me get the second one. So much paper in this one. Like they stuffed this thing with paper. they would have a you know in the Jordan ones on the inside they have a tag with the date and stuff but I don't see that on this one but yeah this was the uh, Jordan 5 Midnight Navy purplish blue um, I don't know they call them like reverse grapes or, or whatnot but so that's what they are pretty pretty used up I've worn them once or twice uh, let me know what you think about them your thoughts if you own a pair um, and then I found it hard, like, what do you rock this with? I mean, I guess you can throw in an all-black. The, the easy go-to is an all-black outfit with these on, maybe some all-black joggers or whatever. But beyond that, like, what else do you wear with them? Um, I'm guessing if you were, like, a, uh, a Hornets fan, maybe a, a Hornets jersey. Probably, actually, that would go great with these because uh, they got that this kind of colorway in it. Also, I think it has that 3M on the tongue also. I don't know if the light hits it right. I don't know. But just giving y'all a look at the Jordan 5, which is pretty rare because, you know, behind me I have all those Jordan 1s. This is like one of two Jordan 5s. I had, um, like a, I think they were called like the Poison Green or whatever, but I sold those a while ago. I was never going to wear them. It was all white, and this part was like green and pink or whatever. Um, I, I, just, I don't even know why I bought them, but anyway, just to give y'all a good look at these, let me know what you think. Um, these probably gonna go back in the box and back on the shelf. I don't even know if I'll wear them again. And it, be, it being used, I don't, I don't even know if anyone would buy them. They're a size 14, and you can see they're they're, they're a little worn on the uh, toe box. So it's really, I don't know. Hey, if you see them and you want them, just make me an offer. I probably, you know, we can talk about it. But beyond that, it'll be on the shelf in the box, back on the shelf. Hey, it's Calvin now on Kicks. Just giving y'all a look at another pair that I had in the collection. Um, I've done a review back way back before, and that video was terrible. So I figured I'd do a better review of a better camera. I got some lighting going on here, and we got the wall of ones. This this uh, magnificent work in progress. So hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Let me know what you think, and I will see you guys on the next video.